God bless you, my friends. Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. here, and I pray that you're having a wonderful day. Listen, I want to make an announcement to you, something that you probably know by now, but the God of the Bible, last Saturday, the 16th of July, made a decision. He exercised his divine prerogative, and he took another saint of God from labor to reward. The beloved matriarch of the Upper Room Church of God in Christ, my spiritual mother, a woman of God if there's ever been one, Mother Willardine Turner went home to be with the Lord on Saturday, July the 16th, around 2 p.m. in the afternoon. What a life she led, what a woman of God she was, and she will be greatly missed. On Saturday, the 23rd, we will be having the homegoing service here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. And yours truly will be officiating the service. And I tell you, I, I'm soliciting your prayers. If you can get here, come. If not, pray for us. Oh, we're in a place that we've never been in before. With her being the founding mother and the matriarch of the church, the upper room has never functioned uh, without her being on earth. And now she's with the Lord and our task is to carry on. And in the name of Jesus Christ, with the strength of God, the Holy Spirit, carry on we shall. So my friends, I wanted to bring this before you. I know that you've been praying for her. I know that you prayed that God would bless her to recover from her illness. And the wonderful thing is that she beat all of the benchmarks that the doctor said that she wouldn't. And by the way, uh, in 2007, about 15 years ago, God healed her of lung cancer, which means that the Lord added to her life 15 more years. What a mighty God we serve. Now she's up there in heaven with the Lord God of the Bible, and she has seen by now the Lord Jesus Christ and her beloved, the late great James Henry Turner, her husband and pastor. Oh, my pastor, the man who preached me out of my sins. So we are soliciting your prayers. And uh, whereas this is somber news, when we look at it from the natural, it is news to rejoice on when we think about it in the spiritual. However, tonight, tonight, tonight is our Bible study night. And God has given me a word to share with the people of God. So now I want you to tune in and I want you to join me tonight right here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. Oh, man, now listen, I'm going to be talking about something that uh, that's not very popular. I'm, I'm going to be speaking on a subject, uh, uh, using words and a word that many preachers today try to avoid. Well, you know what? Here at the upper room, we do not avoid God's truth, but we stand on the truth of God and we believe the God of the Bible and we believe the Bible. I said to some people who was examining me the other day that the Bible is more current than tomorrow morning's newspaper, and I stand on that. So join me here tonight at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ for <laughs> Bible study. Yes, Bible study. I got you on that one, didn't I? We're going to study the word of the Lord together. I will see you tonight right here. God bless.